so this is an educational video uh, about uh, creating a very basic uh, radiographic guide for a partially edentulous case where we are going to be making um, uh, we're going to be placing selected implants to support the removal of partial denture in a common situation this is the patient's cast with the existing rpd and we're going to use this i'm making a very so i'll just show you an inexpensive way on how to proceed what i have here i have some petroleum jelly i have a uh, silicon putty this particular one is the aquasil and i also have monomer and powder uh, this is clear powder for uh, ortho right so it can be it can be clear so I'm gonna start by basically applying some Vaseline on the cast that I'm gonna be using for uh, the guide fabrication. If there are any undercuts, you could also use some, uh, uh, you know, some kind of blocking medium, anything from Play-Doh to resin to wax to whatever you prefer. Okay, so I'm gonna be rather generous with that. Great. All right, so we have that done. The other thing that I'd like to do is, and you see there's some undercuts here, which I really don't, don't care as much in having that amount of detail when I'm making the radiographic guide. Okay, so some of this I will most likely block by using some uh, rope wax. It's pretty easy, pretty cheap to find. And it comes in a package like this. You won't need much. So I am eliminating all undercuts by basically placing wax here. Okay. Anything, any area that you might see open and, and silicone may go there, we don't really need that. Okay, so I'm applying wax there. Okay, great. So that's pretty much how it's supposed to look. Hope you can. Okay, now I have this little putty in my hands. It's uh, homogeneous in color. You don't want to see any little flakes of white in there. If you do, just go ahead and mix it. It has plenty of working time. Setting time is about five minutes. That's all I need. And what I'm gonna do here is apply it like this. You basically making an impression of this cast. You wanna make sure that it's thick enough in all areas so it doesn't prevent you from using it and you're able to remove it without any tearing or anything like that. Okay. So now, it's time to mix our acrylic. That is better. So I want you to see this consistency. It's very putty-like. do it here and now you get here this is all this has all had uh, KY jelly on it. And you position it. This is it. Now, you're either going to hold it like that or put a little uh, rubber band. Great. And you can you just put that in the hot water.
okay, part three of this. This is what we got when we remove this. A lot of work needs to be done here, but we got something to work with. Some excesses here, as you see. I'm gently going to try and remove this, okay? Perfect. Okay. You need to be prepared for this. Okay, this is easy to fix, by the way. I'm not gonna slip, uh, lose sleep over it. All right. Uh, but you get the idea. I'm actually gonna use it to trim it. And now I can start trimming, okay? This, of course, will be removed and put back on the cast. It's nice to have a duplicate cast of this. If this is your only cast. Okay, we made a copy of the removable partial denture of the patient uh, in clear acrylic. Two ways to work now. We can either make holes on the individual teeth because this is going to be a survey crown removable partial denture case. The survey crowns will be placed on implants. So we can make holes and put some radio opaque in there, good aperture being the simplest thing that we could. Or the other way to do this is utilize this. These are scannies. The scannies are radio-opaque markers, okay, and can be used, they're stickers, they can be used on individual teeth. The advantage of the scannies is that you can actually see the emerges profile and the contour of the whole crown. I just took some cones of Gouda Percha and basically stuffed them in there. In that process, I had the help of a electric waxer, pretty much, that allowed me to make sure that everything is nice and uh, melted in there. Uh, and now we have a radiographic partial denture guide, if you will.